What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another Tesla video. Uh, today we're going to be talking about the YouTube login bug. So about a year ago I did a video on two ways to fix the YouTube login bug as you can see here, the insecure browser error message. Uh, if you get this on your screen, couldn't sign you in, the browser app may not be secure. Please try using a different browser. Uh, there's two ways to fix it. And as of today, those two ways no longer work. I've been getting a lot of comments saying, hey, uh, can you help me? What's going on? How come these two methods don't work anymore? Uh, so in today's video, I'm going to explain to you why those methods don't work anymore and why a simple over there update from Tesla can actually fix this problem. Uh, it's relatively easy. And I'm going to give you like one other way that hopefully will fix your problem if you have it. Uh, let's start with that and then we'll go into why it happens and everything else. So if you just want to have your problem fixed, let's do that first. And then if you're interested in, in the more technical aspect, we'll cover that. So first off, let's try to fix this. All right. So I've heard some people have success with this. You go to the web browser uh, and then at the top, you go to uh, dropbox.com and you log in with your Google account and it may or may not work. I've heard mixed reviews. I've heard some people say, yeah, it works great. Other people saying uh, it doesn't work. Uh, it doesn't help. So you just hit sign in in the top right uh, and then you click your Google account and uh, hopefully that logs you in. You still might get the message if you do, uh, then you're going to have to wait for a Tesla over there update. But just hit sign in with Google here and like zoom it in so you guys can see. And hopefully that fixes it for you. Uh, again, this may or may not work, uh, but I've heard some success with this. The old method was Plex, and then there's also changing uh, stuff on your Google account, which is the video I did last year. It does not work anymore. So hopefully the Dropbox thing fixes it for you guys. Uh, if not, Tesla update. After creating this video, there's another method that was being shared around, and I figured I should put it in here for you guys, and hopefully this fixes your problem. Uh, CJ was nice enough to post in my last video. So basically you have to go to runescape.com, uh, click view full site, and then hit sign in and join, and sign in with your Google account, and you should be able to log in. Uh, you don't have to disable two-step or turn on insecure app access. So hopefully this helps you uh, fix your login account issue. All right, so why is this happening? Uh, what, what changed? Uh, the YouTube app and the web browser are the same thing. So when you actually open up the YouTube app, it's just opening up a full screen web browser. And if you go to the web browser, it's the same as going to the YouTube app. So uh, Google changed the sign in process uh, from a security perspective where you can't have uh, embedded web pages sign in uh, anymore. Uh, and this is from a security and safety standpoint uh, because embedded browsers can steal your login credentials fairly easily. Uh, generally speaking. So from Google's perspective, it was like a security change. Uh, from Tesla's perspective, uh, you obviously can't sign in anymore. Uh, part of the reason why, and you should be able to sign in on a browser, is because they are using a developer uh, Chromium, uh, not like a stable release. So I'll show you that. So the problem and the reason why the Tesla browser can't actually log in is because it is showing up as a debug build rather than like a stable build. And it's literally just this user agent string which is embedded in your browser, which you can't change. It has to come from Tesla. So the minute Tesla does an over there update and says, hey, this is like a stable build of Chromium rather than a beta build, uh, you'll be able to log in again. So it's pretty pretty easy fix on Tesla's perspective. And I'm kind of disappointed they haven't done it already. Uh, hopefully they do it soon uh, and as far as I know, the there aren't really any fixes or anything you can do on your end. Hopefully the Dropbox one works for you. Uh, again, I've heard some people have success, but uh, this might be something that just doesn't work until Tesla gets a over there update. Uh, and maybe we can tweet Elon and say, hey, please fix this, right? So it kind of sucks, and uh, I wish I had a better answer for you guys. I did a little bit of research. I was really hoping that it would happen to mine to see if I can find a workaround or something. But uh, from all the research and everything I've looked at, it's basically impossible. So uh, probably not the answer you want to hear, but uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like, uh, thumbs up. Uh, it's not my fault it doesn't work. Uh, make sure to 
leave a comment down below let me know if you're still having the problem and i'll be sure to let you guys know as soon as there is a fix or an update uh so make sure you're subscribed to the channel and i'll let you guys know then most importantly thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time